Hello and welcome back to Craftimation 101. In our last episode, we started a new series uh, to try and look at this new update and to eventually, hopefully, expand out and see what else is on this island or this this piece of land that we've that we've got to work with here that we haven't seen yet in the game. So far, the stuff we've covered has been basically the stuff that uh, we saw the last time. Um, a couple of a couple of maybe some changes, but for the most part, the same. But it's it's been a little while, and so it's now time to you know take a look again and see if we can figure, see if we can find uh, what else is new and what may have changed and things like that. So we left off with making sand and then making glass. Now we had the crate sand uh, directive up there, but we didn't actually look at how to make it, and we just do that by burning soil, I guess. So we'll just do that. Uh, put that down. I'll just grab a, I'll grab a fire out of one of these bonfires, and we'll make some sand. And then glass is the same thing again. Uh, heat up the sand, melt the sand, uh, and that gives us uh, gives us a glass object. So we need to get somebody set up to do that. So let's see. Let's do. Um, let's grab our other wise here. Oh, you were doing. You were doing steel. Do we want you to do steel? Not this way, anyway. So let's go ahead and just uh, clear this program here. And uh, you want to find and pick... Actually, no, wait. You want to make fire. Uh, let's make fire. And then find and pick uh, sand. Or uh, earth, rather. And that makes sand. But then we need to make the... Um, we need to make the glass. So let's have you drop that sand in a temporary spot. And let's have you drop it on the ground. Uh, we can put it right here. That should be fine. And then I want you to make fire again. And then grab the sand from where you dropped it, same place here. And then, that's glass, so now you can, oh, you gotta combine that, don't you? Oh, I missed the combine back here, too. Okay, combine that, combine this too, but uh, put it put it back here, in that, in that spot right there. <laughs> Uh, that that makes that makes glass, and then this make or that makes sand, and then this makes glass, and then we can do our check and eat, and so that'll go here, and then you can go to idle. And I think that'll work. Let's give that a shot at least. But we probably should go back to making some more steel, but I also want to make some. Um, some bonfires because I want to start spreading out our bonfire grid a little bit and so we have uh, where do we want to do this that's a good question we want to put we want to, we want to eventually be right where we can get this bonfire uh, and a bonfire down here which is actually off the map or is it right on the edge it's right on the edge to touch but we also can do one to where it's out here also so I think we should do that first let's put just put one here We'll grab a fire to put in there. And then we want to push further. Uh, why is it not? Oh, I think I need to have a few. That's right. It goes here. What did I do? Did I mess you up? How did I mess that up? Oh, wait, I didn't have you, I didn't have you drop the, uh, I didn't have you drop the glass. See, I knew I'd mess it up. Uh, oops. No, don't do that. No, don't do that either. Excuse me. I'd like to click there, please. There we go. I missed a step. Uh, we need to have a drop to here to deliver it. There. And here. And go. Sorry about that. Sorry about that, chief. I can go there manually. Oh, let's see. So... Um, let's make, yeah, let's make another, make another fire. Hmm. Okay. Let's do, we got a lot of, a lot of fires over here. Ooh, another storage box. That's nice. And a battery. All right, we'll put that in the storage box. And a charged steel plate. So I have to figure out uh, how we do those later. Uh, well, it'll tell us how we do it. You get the idea. Uh, let's see. I'm going to move this one now out here, I think. And that should be right. Since it's ready to ready to burn out. And eventually this one needs to get 
deprecated as well because it's not in a good spot. Now let's see there and there. Yeah, let's go there. So I think what I should do is change the one that delivers to this to deliver out here instead. Yep, you. Uh, so instead of delivering to 13.5, I want you to deliver to 9.7. And then eventually this one will go out. We could we could force it a little faster if we wanted by pulling all the fires out of it so that it only has the one that's actively burning in it still. And we can expand it in the other directions too, but I want to use these two fires to push the um, to push our kind of you know grid out. Actually, maybe I should have done this down on the corner of that. That's it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Might have been a better place to, to base the grid. Um, instead of there, putting it like down here someplace. That'll be okay. Uh, this one, I want to move down here now. Oops, sorry, sorry. We froze over the iron now uh, because we need to move it. Let's go that one. No, it's got to go a little bit further. Here, I think. And then those two should be able to be dealt with. Uh, that one I need to keep alive, though, uh, manually for a little while, which I can't see it very well. And we're going to have to keep that one alive, too. So let's grab... Uh, is it you? Yes. Uh, let's copy this program to another craft mate. And then we're going to give you a couple of jobs to do. Uh, and st or a couple of different fires to maintain. You can maintain this one and this one. Uh, no, wait, not that one. I'm sorry. Uh, this here. Edit that one to be this one. This one can go away. Got one to burn. Got six to burn. That'll be fine. Okay, good. Uh, this one will be used to help me expand some more later. So we've got plenty of iron exposed. We could actually make, start having somebody make some iron, or some steel rather, uh, which probably would be a good idea. We had that at one point, we should have it again. So let's make fire and then uh, find and pick iron and then combine. And I want you to drop it to, I think probably this box here. And then let's do a check and eat. And then to idle. I think that's all we want. Just to just make make a bunch of steel bars. Uh, we don't need like we don't need the metal plates right now, I don't think, the steel plates. We're just working on this glass anyways. Uh, we just need to have those those uh, bars. Because we'll use them for a few other things later. I think I want to get this chunk of rock moved so they can walk through here. And this fire here is technically temporary. Uh, there should technically be one down here, and then we won't have a problem keeping this all warm. But for now, it is what it is. Uh, now we need magnets. All right. The magnets are made by combining steel with iron. Where is, where's our glass maker at? Because I need to change you. Probably just gonna wait until I see them pick up the, the sand because it's too hard to identify who's got what job, probably. There you are. Okay. So instead of delivering glass there, I would actually, well, maybe we just don't do glass for right now um, because we don't have another box to put it in. We could make boxes as we found out before, but making boxes means we need to have, oh, we have everything. We have the steel plate and we have the glass. Yeah, we can make another box. Let's make one. 
We got a steel plate here. We got glass there. So why don't you keep making glass? Uh, because we can use it to make these other things. But instead of dropping it to the station there, uh, drop it here instead and proceed. We've got Zaz and Heh the smart. We have Heh the, the funny. Heh the ugly. Heh the goofy. That's who it is. Uh, a lot of Hehs. Uh, so you need to find... Let's see, this will be a simple one. You need to find and pick steel. And then find and pick iron. Combine those to make a magnet. And then drop it to right here. Uh, do the uh, food check. And then go to idle. No fire needed. Um, technically, you're going to grab these much faster than the person making them. But it's okay. Because you can make magnets that way anyway. And then we'll get those 10 made. And in the meantime, we can work on doing maybe some more expansion. Uh, this would actually be a good place to at least temporarily expand it to. Because there's a box of batteries here. So let's move these batteries into the new box. Or the old box that had the batteries. And then we can use this new box for something else. Whatever we decide to use it for. Maybe we have somebody make steel plates. We probably would need to have two, um, uh, at least two people making steel, or we have to just have somebody make steel plates natively. Maybe that's best. Maybe that's best. Uh, so who's our steel guy? You? No. Uh, you? Yes. So let's copy your program to this one. That's not going to be confusing at all. They're both named Heh. So you're making steel. Uh, making fire, making, and then finding an iron and making that to steel. Let's um, let's, let's, let's change this now a little bit so that uh, instead of dropping that steel uh, in that box, actually, yes, you should still drop that steel in that box. That's fine. And then I want you to go f uh, make fire again and then find and pick another iron. Combine them to make another steel and then find and pick steel. You're going to find it in the box you put it in, but find and pick steel. Combine those to make uh, two steel together, which makes one of the iron plates, or the steel plates, rather. And then uh, deliver that to this box right here. And then we'll have a box of steel plates now. Uh, then you need to do your food check. And then you need to go to idle. And go. Let's do another fire, I think on fire. So much fires over here. A hot spot. Alright, so here's another craft mate, so if we want something else to get done, we can have somebody else do it. Oh, we finished this already. Oh, okay. Uh, why don't you... Come here. Not you. Get out of the way. You. Pause. Uh, let's put these batteries away. We could switch to um, feeding them batteries, but we don't have a renewable supply of batteries yet. We haven't learned how to make batteries yet. Maybe we have, but I don't know that we have. Battery. Oh, we have. We just don't know how to... We haven't gotten all the way there yet. Okay. Uh, so you can continue making magnets, but I want to make... Um, I want to make another box for you to put them in. Uh, bib, you there. You here and change your drop location to that box. And uh, proceed. There you go. Okay. So now we have magnets getting made. Um, they're getting made, though, from the steel that's getting made, so we may end up um, starving out some, some steel makers, or some steel. Uh, we'll see how that goes. This is a heater. Uh, the heaters are battery-powered... Um, Battery powered bonfires, basically. Oh no. Oh no. You got frozen. What do you got? A battery and a. How did you get there? Reset. I'm not sure how you got what you got. Um, but okay. Go. Keep them fires burning, please. Three, there's only zero. Yeah, there's zero in there. Okay, so let's, let's refuel this one just a bit. 
to make up for it. Uh, I should have retrieved this 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 out of here first. Uh, so heaters are a new type of uh, bonfire type of building. Uh, instead of um, heating in a square, these heat in a giant plus sign. So you can kind of see a little bit of the plus sign here. I can't really show it to you very well, but they heat just a local area next to them. But they also heat in a long straight line in all four directions. So if we did this and we put one of those batteries in there, it would heat up the square around it and then these long straight lines beyond that. Let's actually move these over here maybe. Um, and then what the useful thing about this is, is we can throw one of these bonfires at the end of one to get a much much further range on uh, on what we're trying to get a hold of here. Uh, so see, we found some coal bricks stashed out here, and we also found some paint. This is uh, white paint, and white paint is edible, or paint is edible. Paint is also um, craftable amongst itself, so you can make different colors by combining different colors. Uh, purple and pink make white. Don't try to think too logically about that. Um, but you can combine the colors to make different, uh, to make different colors. So it depends on what colors you're given access to to begin with. Uh, is dependent upon what you know what you want to have, or what is what you're given access to to begin with will depend on what you have access to. But what you what you can make is much wider than that, assuming you have multiple colors access to multiple colors to begin with. Uh, so that's continuing to heat. These are going still. I would like to move one of them out here to try and get those heads. Uh, here's some bodies here too, so we can make a couple more craft mates with it. And then there's wood in that box. Uh huh. Let's do that. And then let's move this one over here. Do that. So we'll grab these heads, drop them there, and use this box or take this box with us. And then I want you to stay burning a little bit longer than that one. We don't really need anything else over here. Oh, there's some wood down there too. Maybe we do, but we can get that one. Uh, but we need to find ice. That's what we're working to do. And there is ice up here. So we actually should have kept that area thought out. Let's do this first. Let's do the ice first. Uh, Cause that actually leads to the next thing too. So let's find some ice. Uh, right here ice and then we can make water and we make water by combining ice and fire and that's the next thing we need for this so we should probably establish our uh our heater grid out here two there one two right here uh let's do one more fire right there and then let's put this bonfire down right there and you're just about out the batteries last a long time in the, in the heaters but we do not, um, they don't last forever, so. This moves down here, and then we wanna find this person, who is this one right here, Oppo. And I wanna add some more steps to you. Uh, let's have you do another make fire. And then I want you to drop that to here. Uh, so that goes to there, and then this goes to the check and eat. Here and here. Just give you a couple of extra ones just to keep things going. Our battery ran out, so let's well let's actually let this one burn down first, maybe. Yeah, I think so. And I think I want to get this opened up too. So we'll come down here with the fire and get the storage box full of charged metal plates, or charged steel plates. Might as well. Are you f oh, you're waiting for steel, right? Because we've, yeah, we're, we're taking too much. It might be worthwhile to have the magnet person make their own steel. It might be. So that's steel, that's steel plate. Uh, I guess we could put these charged steel plates over here. Doesn't really matter. I just like to spread them around a little bit. Just have a bunch of storage of different things. 
and then we'll go up that way. I think, though, I want to put this bonfire over here. Or, um, heater, sorry. Heater over, over there. And that way we can do, um, nope, a battery for that. We can do this here. Uh, you need to go right exactly there, actually. How are the two, the folks doing two heaters keeping up? Or two bonfires keeping up? Barely, but they're keeping up. So we could use another bot. I think we'll do this here. Oh no, we have these two down here already. <laughs> Alright, uh, fifth, uh, you can take a copy of this one, uh, to you, and then you can, instead of dropping to 23.7, 29.7, for now you can just drop both to 23.13. And that means, or that, that means that they'll, it'll deliver twice as much to that one, but that's actually okay, at least for now, because we're gonna make another fire anyway. Should probably make a couple. We're gonna get a hold of that wood. Uh, so, oh, we—that's right. We were trying to make a bot to do the to do this, but we—I was trying to get out here and have a permanent, permanent settlement or permanent uh, fire out here. Make a couple more fires. That's what we were working on. Okay, uh, you fire. And then this one here, fire. And so now we have fifth that we could edit to have them deliver fire here too. I'll give you a few extra fires to burn in there. But that gives me easy access or uh, steady access to ice, I should say. And that's what we want is steady access to the ice. So now we can grab a new bot. What are you waiting for Zaz? Are you a program bot? You're making... Oh, you're making magnets, but you didn't have access to the yep, to the steel. Okay. I think I'm going to have to change you to have you make your own... Make your own steel. I think that's probably the best. So let's pause you. Um, hmm. Let's just delete it and start again. Uh, make fire. And then find and pick iron. Combine. Find and pick iron again. Because the first one makes steel. And then the second one makes... Makes magnets. Combine those. And then do your check and eat. And then drop two... Oh, no, I forgot to drop two first. Drop two first. Well, that's fine, I guess. Uh, drop two here first. And then uh, check and eat. And then title. Go. Okay. I guess I could probably leave that down there. Okay, so we have we have wood we have access to wood now. Oh, we are working on ice. I keep forgetting about where we're at. Uh, you, Pip, you can make fire, and then you can um, find and pick ice. And then combine those to make water. And then drop the water to here. And then you can do your eat check. And I don't. Alright, that should do that. You can see we have a couple more paints out here. Green there and a teal there. Uh, so we'll be able to use those as well for things. So now we're making 10 water to deliver to the to the uh, command center, and that'll get us the next stage. We do, those have one coin available, uh, one upgrade token, so we could do that direction thing, which I don't really understand a use for yet. There's a comparison that we talked about. There's also variables that we talked about. I haven't really gotten really deep into the programming or what you can do with this uh, since my last series. Um, hopefully there's more you can do with it now, but um, for now I don't know which one I want to do next. And I think I'm going to wait anyways, because there's not... Uh, 
Not one that I know that I want to use. So, teal paint. Um, means it can be made from green and purple. And then we have green paint over here. Which can be made from white and teal. So we could take this white and teal that we have here and make it green. Now you can't combine two of the same colors for anything. Uh, that doesn't work. Uh, but I, what I think I want to do with these is come up with a color scheme that I like. Uh, so for example, maybe we want... Are you going to run out of juice before? No, you're alright. Uh, maybe we want all the green ones to do a thing. Maybe we want all the teal ones to do a thing. And I think we can figure out what we might want each of them to do. I should have not stolen from that fire. Let's leave these active for just a bit because I want to clean these things out too. So you are a, you're a fire making bot. So let's, let's maybe make you teal. You'll eat that and you become teal. And you're a fire bot now. Uh, and then this one also is a, is a fire bot. So we can have you maintain that. That way we can at least track where they are on the map. Which ones are just restocking fires. Which ones are doing other things. Uh, if I can find the one that's stocking that one. And the ones that are stocking these two down here. We can do the same for those. You. And you. Great. And so then we can just pick a different color and make those each of those colors be for those different things. Uh, here's a few more batteries. So to help us keep our... our uh, um, heater running. Then we have a few more of the charged plates too. Which we can actually make now. Because uh, we, we looked at the recipe for that a little while back. And we found out how to make those. And those are magnets plus regular steel plate. And we have the stuff, so we should do that at some point. Uh, maybe we do, maybe some out here or something. Uh, and then batteries go here. That can go there, maybe. And then we can move those fires on to do something else. Alright, so we are at just about 10 water. And then we need to make uh, boiling water, which is add another fire to the water that you have already. And so we'll do that uh, momentarily. Okay, there's number 10. I want you to make one more so that I can make the boiling water from it. Although I could do it, I guess. That would be fine. To pause you and reset. Then we just need to take a fire and boil the water. And that makes boiling water. And boiling water is used, as we saw, in making batteries. Along with the charged steel plate. So we have to start making charged steel plate now. Okay, um, so... Let's see, we probably want somebody to make... Boiling water constantly now, I think. So you can make... Uh, water. We already know how. You already know how to make water. Let's have you then just drop that water there. Uh, did you drop it there? Yeah. Okay. And then let's do. Um, let's make another fire. And then pick up. Uh, we can actually just do find and pick the water that you dropped. Combine those to make boiling water. And then let's drop those in a box. Uh, maybe this box right here would be fine. And then you want to do your uh, check and eat and your idle and go. So now you can move on to making boiling water and putting it in that box. Got a bunch of batteries. Put those away. Put those away. Put those away. All right. Uh, so you want charged steel plate. That is a magnet in a, in a, in a steel plate, I believe. Uh, charged steel plate. Yep, magnet and steel plate. So we have the magnets, we have the steel plates. Let's just do a bot that can make those uh, really quickly. Find and pick steel plate. Find and pick magnet. Combine. Drop to 
right here. Check and eat, as always, and then to idle. Go. And we only have 16 charged steel pla or steel plates, and we have 45 magnets. So we'll be eventually run out, but we're only going to make 10 or 11 of those like this, and then we'll have to decide. Oh no, you ran out of juice. How do you run out of juice? Probably because you were late in your cycle. Yeah, you were late in the cycle when I uh, when I interrupted you. So you probably needed to eat that cycle that I interrupted. Actually, that one might need to stay there. Even though it's closer than these other ones, it might need to stay there because this one's gonna go here. There should be another one here. Yeah, so it, my grid's not that good. <laughs> That's okay. I'm not gonna reheat those. Or actually, maybe I should heat this one up again so that I can pull this one out of here. And then we can just keep these wherever we want them for now. Ah, we finished that already? The light bulbs are next? You, excuse me, excuse me. I know, you eat three times, I know. Uh, reset program. Maybe a little bit of food though, because we're pretty much out. Another, another bot here. Actually, don't put you all the way over there. Put this here. Uh, light bulbs are next, but I think, well, actually let's see what the light bulb recipe is. Oh, radio lamp, yes, light radio lamp. Uh, the charged steel plates, we need to actually have a way to make those consistently, plus uh, a piece of glass, which we are also making constantly. So I think what we should maybe do is find the steel plate maker, uh, wherever that person might be. Is that you? No, you're just making straight up steel. Find the steel plate maker and copy them onto another bot. You? Yes, you. Yep. Uh, copy to, let's say this one. And then go ahead and run and just do the same thing. So we have two bots making steel plates. And I think that'll help offset the numbers here a little bit. Uh, the magnets are pretty, are doing pretty well. Like we have a lot of them. Uh, and so I think we're okay there. But we'll see. Uh, so you can actually continue again, but I want you to drop them here instead. Go. And then we need one of these plus one of these to make the radio lamp. And of course, to deliver it to there. And why don't you, Ihi, why don't you do this? Uh, find and pick a charged steel plate. And then find and pick a glass. Combine. And drop it to right there. And then this one. And then this one. Excellent. Now we're gonna get into the organic stuff. So we've done a lot. You're dead again. Well, that's not what you wanted. Well, that gave you 1%. Oopsie. Did I not put the eat? I didn't. No no wonder. Okay. Uh, do that. That's why you're starving. Oops. Uh, yeah. There you go. Sorry. It's one way to find out. Find out the hard way. Uh, so we should also have somebody make batteries, maybe. And then we can actually have them start eating batteries. The biggest issue is, are we making enough stuff to feed the battery making? Uh, are we make, And we're using those charged steel plates to make the... Um, to make the radio lamps right now. So are we making enough stuff to make batteries or should we beef up some production someplace you're oh we're out of fuel your problem is you're hungry and your problem is you're hungry where's the bot making the charcoal briquettes right there 
We need another one of you. Oh. Oh. Okay. That means we need to figure out how to make bots. We know how to make bots, though. Uh, battery and a steel plate, and then a radio lamp and a steel plate to make a bot. Okay, so battery and a steel plate. And another steel plate and a radio lamp. Wait, we didn't make radio lamp yet. We're working on those still. There and there. Uh, who's making fuel? Charcoal briquettes. You? Yes, you. Zaz, uh, copy. To Fef. Why don't we make you green? If we can find Zox right there. Make you green as well. And you can go and help with the uh, with the briquette making. That'll help. What's up, Pick? Oh, you're hungry. You can't find charcoal. Yep. Okay. We'll get there. We just got to get everybody back alive again. I guess I could probably help. That might be helpful if I helped. I'll just make some and just throw them here on the ground. And then you all who need them can come and get them. And you could use one right now. Well, now we know there's a limit to how many bots we can reasonably support on one bot making fuel. And it's a lot, but it's not a huge number. Um, so having, uh, what the heck is that? Copper? Is that copper? Must be copper. It was copper ore. Uh, copper bars there. So we've got a lot of stuff we can do before we get to the next command center level. We need to make a few more bots, though. Oh, furnaces. These are fun, too. These have a very, very hot central point. As you can see, the red there. And then they have a much larger range than the bonfires do. And then they go to making... Um, and then they have a, still have the border edge area. And these need wood to burn. So we have to start growing trees with the wood. And we need to craft a seed as the first step here. We have two wood. And then we craft a seed with wood and water. Uh, we have water, but we are also making boiled water for the uh, uh, batteries, which we aren't actually making batteries. So maybe I should grab, was it you who's making water? Yes. Uh, which means we need to actually make another bot. All right, one of these and one of those. One of these and a radio lamp here. Oops. You stole my battleship. Okay. Um, still selected on the, the water maker. Yep. Uh, let's copy that to the new one. And I want you to just make water. Straight up water. So we don't... Let's see. This is where you make water. This is garbage then. So is this. So is this. And instead of dropping to there, I want you to drop the water into there. Oopsie. Drop it into there. That'll give us water. And I think that'll be good. There's a source of water, that is. I wonder if the temperature actually does matter. Um, there is a thermal map here, and really the only really warm spots you can see there are red. Uh, really hot spots, I mean, the warmth here is pretty good, and then the green here, where it's, um, you know, it's it's slightly less, must be good as well, because it's enough to make grass or moss grow, but maybe I do actually want the, the, the bonfires, or maybe later even the furnaces, uh, a little bit closer together so that we have enough overlap in them to at least get to the green area, but I honestly don't know how that works. What is your problem? Why was there one there? Oh. Oh, oops. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. There you go. Uh, reset. Oh, and you're finding and picking up. Okay, yep. So, uh, where's the um, ice maker? 
Because they need to just drop their water right there. Is that you? Yeah. So instead of dropping your water where you were dropping it, drop it down here. That way you can just use the water that's there too. Okay. Uh, so now we can make... Uh, well, first of all, the radio lamp guy probably needs to be paused. Uh, oops. Reset. Reset. There you go. Thank you. Because I don't know how many of those I want to make right now. Netting a little bit positive there on the... That's good. Uh, we'll put those aside with you for now. Uh, so we want to make some seeds. And we make seeds by combining wood and water. Here. And that gives us some kind of a plant. I think it's a mushroom. Or a tree. Or something. And it needs water. Uh, it needs to be... Well, it depends where it is. If it's cold, it runs at half speed. If it's warm, it runs at one and a half speed. If it's hot, uh, where's the hot spot at? Uh, thermal map? Uh, we can't anywhere. These will make some hot spots though. We don't have any, well, we do have one wood. Uh, warm is good though. Uh, we, can, we can live with warm, I think. So warm, it runs at one and a half speed. It just needs water. We can deliver that water ourselves and then it'll grow. Uh, just got another achievement for the farmer. Make craft mate to water a tree. Well, I didn't get somebody to do it. I did it myself. But uh, then it grows, and it's starving for water again. Uh, it's now a, a little tree, a little sapling, and we need to keep growing it. So I think what we should do is program a bot to do that. What is your problem? You were hungry? Oh, we ran out of food. Well, I guess I lied about having a stockpile already because we ran out again. And then the one of the ones that needs to, the one of the ones that needs to make food is now waiting to eat more. Hmm. So maybe I need a third one to do that. Let's grab that program again. If I can catch one of you that's got the program. You? Yep. Uh, let's copy that to this one that was making radio lamps. And have them work on it too. Uh, we'll grab a green. I can't. Well, I could grab. I guess. Uh huh. I have no idea where you went. There you are. So now we have three. Okay. It's fine. These little bits of stone. I feel like they're nice to pick up. So we could use a bot to do the watering for us. I think for right now, I'll just water it for us. Uh, we'll have to set up a farm at some point. And I'm guessing we want them to be in warm or hot zones to make them grow faster. But we'll want to have a little bit of a tree farm at some point. Ah, there's our tree. So it's ripe now, and it produces four wood. So it must have been about four water. Um, was it, th was it f three to grow the tree, plus one, one to make the seed uh, to turn into four wood? And now we need to find... We have those. Over here. Okay, there we go. We have some space around the furnace. Uh, I think it's clear. I'm, I'm not sure what you mean by clear up. I don't know what that means then, I guess. Um, so let's just harvest the wood out here. See what happens. It's completely gone. Okay. So then we can grow another tree by making a new seed to, to start. So that was uh, one water. Here's two water. Three 
Green water. More water? Is that done? Yep. Okay. So it's kind of a fair, a fair amount, I guess. And then one wood goes back into growing another tree. So we could feed this into a bonfire now. Oh, that's where you want it. Okay, I didn't see the flashy thing over there. Let's go over here and uh, feed one wood into this. And what does that do? That melts this uh, this differently colored ice. Interesting. Okay. Oops, I made a spark. Place that to mount the ancient, ancient ice tiles. Oh, interesting. Okay. Here. Yeah. So we must not be able to melt those with the regular bonfires. What the heck? Hmm. Here, have some more uh, stone down here, please. So I probably should put one here and one here so we can get into this, I guess. It says it's hot. Why does it not let me harvest it? Yeah, we need to make a pass through the ancient ice. But actually, looking at the time, I think maybe we should delay that until the next episode. And try it then. Uh, just because I don't know how much that's effort that's going to take, and we'll have to see what that what that ends up being. Uh, for now, you can have fire there uh, with that spark. So, um, yeah, so let me know what you guys just thought. Are we going to a few new things? I don't know if we had boiling water before. I don't know that we had radio lamps before uh, in, in the previous series. Um, and we definitely just ba kind of barely got to this point of, you know, the time where we can make batteries, I think, and the time we can make the charged steel plates and, and things. But I don't think we went further than that. So anyway, let me know your thoughts and we will, uh, we will continue our look at this in the next episode. So thank you all for joining me and I will see you all then. Bye for now.